Today, we are going to learn how to focus a microscope, and first we're gonna learn about its parts. Let's go. So, in order to focus anything, you're gonna to need to know the on switch because you need light. Turn it on. On the side of your microscope, you'll notice a dial. This dial changes how much light is coming up through your specimen. So you always wanna make sure that you have light coming up through your specimen. Underneath the stage is a sliding part and if you move it back and forth, you'll see that it also allows light to go up through the stage. So if you're not getting light through your specimen, check to make sure that this lever is to a point that allows the light to go through. This part of the microscope is the stage. This is where you're going to put your slide or your specimen. And if you notice here, this part, we have some stage clips, and this is the area where you're going to put your slide when you're getting ready to focus something. These are the eyepieces of the microscope or ocular lenses. This microscope has two, some have one. It's designed for you to look with two eyes. So if your eyes are a little bit wider, you can slide this apart. If they're a little bit closer together, you can slide it inward. Each of these eyepieces has a magnification of 10 times. That's important when we calculate total magnification. Now we can look at the actual objective lenses. The one that I have right here is the shortest one. This is the four times objective. So when we're looking at total magnification, we're gonna take the eyepiece objective, which is 10 times, times this right here, 10 times four, this would be 40 times magnification. In order to go to the next magnification, we just simply spin this gently and hear it click. You want it to click in place, and if it doesn't click in place, you're not gonna get good focus. This next objective is 10 times. So 10 times 10 is 100. So this is 100 times total magnification. The next one, here it click, that's 40. 40 times 10 is 400 times total magnification. This last one that we used for oil immersion and looking at bacteria, this is 100. 100 times 10 is 1,000 times magnification. So to focus, your focusing knobs are here. And this is actually a double knob. The inner part of it is what we call your course adjustment. And this will raise and lower the stage to make really large adjustments to your focus. The inner knob right here is your fine adjustment and it does not move the stage greatly up or down. This is for very fine focusing. So you're going to use your coarse adjustment and you'll use your fine adjustment when focusing. There are two small knobs under the stage. The top part, if you rotate it, adjusts the vertical on your slide. And the bottom one, if you twist it, adjusts the horizontal on your slide in order to get your slide where you want it for your focus. So I want to look at the slide of the letter E, but before I do so and even get my slide on the stage, I need to fix what's going on right here. This is a hundred times objective. We always wanna start with our shortest, lowest objective, which is the four times. So that's why I clicked that one into place. Now I'm ready to go. I can take my slide and then I can move this little stage clip and I can just gently make sure my slide is in place. Now that my slide is on the stage, I need to get it in position to look at it. So I'm going to use those knobs that we talked about earlier and I'm gonna get it underneath the light source. And then I'm going to use my horse adjustment, which is this knob, this inner one here to get it in focus. So you wanna use this, you can go all the way up and all the way down with it until you see it. And then if it's not quite perfect, you can use the little inner knob to fix your focus. Now, what you can see is that the letter E looks flipped. And it looks flipped, okay, because when you're looking in the microscope, because of the lenses, everything you're looking at is actually upside down. Which is good to know when you're actually looking through slides to try to find different things when it comes to location and where you need to be going. If I wanna get this up closer, right now I'm only at 40 times, I'm gonna twist the objectives, click it into place, feel the click, hear the click. We're at 10 times 10, which is 100 times. I'm only gonna use the fine adjustment. Do not use the coarse one or you can crack your slide. 
If it's not in focus, bump it back down, get it in focus, then go back up. If you're looking up close at nothing, and then you magnify more, it's still more nothing. So you get it in focus here, and then click it up. So we're at 10 times four, which is 400. Use that fine adjustment. Do not use the 100 on this one. That's only for oil immersion and bacteria. When I'm done with this, I wanna go all the way back down to the four times short one so that I don't crack a slide. Pull this to the side and then I remove my slide and I'm done.